According to a study by a New York-based researcher, Artnet, and the Chinese Association of Auctioneers, the Chinese art market is getting stronger again, following a 43% sales drop back in 2012. The Global Chinese Art Auction Market Report 2013 states that public auctions of Chinese artworks worldwide amount to $8.5 billion last year. That was a 29% jump from 2012, but it still fell short of the $11.5 billion peak that happened in 2011. The expert opinions seem to be that although the market has improved quite substantially, the growth is much slower and it won't be like it was in 2010 and 2011. Of all the Chinese art and antique sales, mainland China accounted for 73% last year. Even during the period when the Chinese art market was expanding between 2008 and 2011, mainland China saw an over 500% rise in sales. But the market has been held back from expanding presently due to a number of issues, such as a proliferation of fakes, late payments, and even non-payments. These have in turn discouraged new buyers and undermined the credibility of Chinese auction houses. By the end of May of this year, 44% of the lots sold by legitimate auction houses in China during 2012 had still not been fully paid for. Still, Artnet's report says that more wealthy Chinese consumers are looking to invest in art. Because the renminbi is still not a fully convertible currency, Chinese investors tend to invest in alternative assets. The largest part of the market was taken up by fine Chinese paintings and calligraphy, making up 66% in terms of value in China. Chinese antiques and artworks were the next biggest sector, making up 20% of sales in China last year.